The pine snags jutting from Quake Lake cast shadows that lanced across the surface. Martha Ettinger followed Harold Littlefeather's eyes as he gazed at this reflective pool, oblivious to her presence. The Blackfeet tracker stood with his hands folded across his belly, his black braid falling down the back of his khaki shirt. He hadn't said one word since they had turned into the campground, and Martha thought better than to interrupt him. She had once seen Harold Littlefeather turn heel on a crime scene because the investigating officer wouldn't shut up. How can I hear the dead man talking when you're blabbering at the mouth, he'd said, and had kicked the mud from his cowboy boots against the step-up of his truck and gunned it for Browning. The department had disciplined him, Martha recalled, but his punishment hadn't been as severe as the officers. He'd been saddled with the moniker Dead Man Talking ever since. 